Uh, I thank one and all for your support, your love, and your concern, without which I would not have been able to make it through this past year. A year ago today, just across the street from the tree and the granite marker, Amy was abducted from a Bay Village shopping center. A little more than three months later, her body was found. Let's fill the void that her passing has left with positive thoughts, with a smile on our face, and say she blessed our life for a while. Unfortunately, she is gone, but now we must live on. City and civic leaders and law enforcement officials spoke of love and community togetherness and the Amy Fund and the continuing search for the child's killer. And we're not going to give up until uh, we see this thing through. Uh, Amy has touched our lives. Uh, she will live forever. The monument says that Amy lives on in our hearts. Amy pulled a community together as a family, and we still are a family, supporting each other, loving each other. We know that Amy is in God's love and care, and his love and care are with us. There was mourning, and there were drawn faces, and there were some tears, but this was not a ceremony of sorrow. Put a smile on. <laughs> Thank you for coming. In Bay Village, John Harrington, Channel 3 News.